This particular one, we're on the matrix, so this is our door vent cover over the outside. These are a requirement that we need to have if we've got cooking inside. So if we've got LPG inside the trailer, it'll have a positive air feed into there. Whether it's in the matrix, whether it was in a quantum and you optioned it up to put a three burner cooker inside on the bench space, this will be fitted to the door as also a vent internally in the roof line. Now to open this, this is part of our dust proofing. This is our traveling setup as it is there now. So as we're ready to hit the road, that's how to be. We're pulling up the setup camp. So first things first, I'll lift up the little tabs. I'll turn that tab, you'll see it fling out a little bit. I'll do the same again. That's popped out. It's still secured, so all I need to do is generally just use your leg, push that away there, and do the same on that end, push that away. That can swivel down on its own. Um, a lot of people leave it like that. You do have to be mindful by having it in that position. When you step up on your step, kicking it each time, potentially that can drop off. So a lot, of, a lot of times when you set up camp, the best thing is to take that off, sit that inside one of your drawers or somewhere like that, secure-wise on there. Now you can see that vent open there. Now from there, I could open the door up completely. Yeah. Okay, now to close this back up, obviously we'll locate it onto the two hinges here. And then I'll just lift that up, and I'm still keeping a bit of pressure that way so it doesn't come back off the hinge. And all I'm doing now is I'm just locating that stainless piece, just holding it in place. So I'm just flicking that over, pushing in a little bit and holding that in place there. I'm critical, and I'll just undo that a little bit more, that that rubber is not sitting up on the hasp there. We need to make sure it goes underneath because when this pulls in, it's going to pull in underneath and seal that off properly. So as I pull that there, turn that there now, you'll see that pull in quite tight and firm. And I'll do the same on the other end. So I'll pull that around and that pulls the whole thing in. Lock them down into place. It can't come undone. It can't fall off unless you haven't done it up properly. Uh, but now that's giving you 100% dust seal around that area there so that's stopping any potential dust coming in from this point, but also coming in through the air filter in the top, uh, the positive air side, it can't keep feeding it inside of there.